Okay, so question asked over email. This is problem 1.1.51, and they want us to translate the phrase into an algebraic expression. And they're telling us that your salary after a 5% increase, if your salary before the increase was S, and they want the expression for this. Okay, so what they're saying basically is, you know, you're starting with a salary of S, and then you're trying to increase it 5%. So you have to think about, first of all, how would you represent 5% of your salary? Um, if your salary is S, then 5% of your salary would actually be represented by 0.05S. So this right here is representing 5% of your salary. Okay, um, and that's, if we take the 5% the here and <clears throat> change percentage into a decimal, then you're essentially moving the decimal place 2 over. It's like taking 5 and dividing by 100. So 5% in terms of a decimal is 0 0.05. Um, so 0 0.05 times S would represent 5% of the salary. And then if I want to um, increase my salary by that amount, I would simply take my S and add 0 0.05 S to it. Okay, and then these are like terms, so I can see that I have 1s and I have 0.05s, so this would be 1.05s would be a 5% increase. Um, so that's that one. And this one right here, problem 1.2.31, they ask us to replace the, the question mark with the inequality symbol either less than or greater than. Um, and they give us negative 19 and 20. So we have negative 19 question mark and then 20. And they want us to use either this one or this one. Now just as a refresher, this is a less than symbol and this is a greater than symbol. Okay, so we have to decide which one of these is less and which one's greater. Well, I mean I hope it's obvious that 20 is greater um, if you just take a look at your number line, you know that 0 divides the negative numbers and the positive numbers. So negative 19 is over here somewhere and 20 is over here somewhere. So 20 is greater than any negative number. Any positive number is greater than any negative number. So we would just say here that negative 19 is less than 20. You can read that a couple of ways. You can read it as negative 19 is less than 20 or you can read it as 20 is greater than negative 19. We always generally read from left to right though when we're when we're reading mathematics, same as we read the English language. So this would just be that symbol right there.